everybody. Welcome back. We are doing something a little bit different for today's upload because I have some big news. Big news, so listen up. So for those who don't know, a while back, I announced that I had written a TV pilot. I wrote this pilot a few years ago, and after three long years of no film industry during COVID, I decided that I was going to produce it in the fall of 2022. The pilot is for a show called The Swipe Life. It's a dramedy about dating apps. I created it, I wrote it, I starred in it, and I executive produced it. So we wrapped up filming in October of last year. And since then, I've been supervising post-production. It takes a long, long time to complete a piece of TV or film. You gotta cut everything together. You gotta do the visual effects. You gotta do the sound and the title sequence. So it's been about six months and we are finally finished. So naturally, I wanna celebrate and I'm gonna celebrate with one of you. Oh my God! Okay, it's happening. Everybody stay calm. What's the Everybody procedure, stay calm. everyone? I want to fly you and a friend out to the screening and wrap party in Toronto on May 27th, 2023. I'm going to put you and your friend up in a nice hotel. You're going to come to the screening and then you're going to come to the after party where you get to meet me and you get to meet the cast and crew. A bunch of my friends are going to be there. My family's going to be there. It's going to be super, super great. So before I get into the contest rules, which you have to follow in order to be considered, I'm going to answer a couple of questions about the pilot that I get asked on a day-to-day -day basis, just so that we are all on the same page. <laughs> a lot of you ask me all the time, how are you going to see the pilot? Where is it being shown? What streaming service is going to be showing it? So when you're making a pilot, what you're doing is you are creating something called a proof of concept. A proof of concept is, I guess, like a proof of your concept that essentially gets a studio or a streaming service interested in producing your entire show. Every TV show that you see on any streaming service on any network has to go through this process. Most people don't fund the making of their pilot like I did. They find investors or a TV studio to fund the making of the pilot. Then once the pilot is finished, it is pitched and shopped around to different networks or streaming services, whatever it may be. And this right here is the stage that we are at right now with the show. I want to make it clear that someone could buy the rights to the show and you might never see this specific pilot that we shot and completed. They might want to reshoot it. A good example is Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones' pilot was never actually seen. They reshot the whole thing along with the series. That's disappointing. Or someone might buy the rights to the show and it might never see the light of day. And this is what happens with most shows. They get bought out and then they never leave the cutting room floor. Yes. Very sad. Anyway. But essentially what I wanted to do with my pilot is I wanted to make it good enough so that it could be like a standalone project. So if I decide it's the best course of action for it, I'm going to set up either channel memberships on YouTube or I'm going to crowdfund where people are going to pay to see it. And then we will use the money from the people who want to support it to earn money for either, let's say, a film or to produce the entire show. It all kind of depends on like how much money it earns. So lots of options for this, lots of avenues that we can go down. Some involve you guys seeing what we shot. Some involve you guys never seeing it. But right now I have a finished product that I'm super, super happy with. I, like it's just, it's so beautiful and it's so funny. I hired a ton of local Toronto comedians that really just made the show like so much better than it already was. And I hired an amazing cinematographer and an amazing director. Oh God, just such a great ensemble of artists came together to make this show a reality. And I'm like so, so grateful. And I really hope you get to see it someday. On to my next point, which is I know why you're even listening past this point. I really want to do a contest because I've never done one on this channel before. And I really want to reward the people who've been such an amazing part of this community who have essentially made all of this possible. So we got the contest rules. Are you ready? You must follow all of these rules in order to be considered. Let's write it down. I will be picking one person and they will be bringing one friend. The contest closes on May 7th. I will pick the winner based on the following criteria. Firstly, you need to be subscribed to this channel using your main account. I did like a little bit of an analytics report and apparently there's like 10 million people who watch this channel and don't subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> so subscribe if you haven't already. Do it, do it now. And I want you to subscribe using your main account because I wanna check your activity on this account. I wanna see what kind of person you've been in this community. And I wanna reward you for being supportive and being positive. Secondly, you're gonna follow me on Instagram at Charlay Chaplin. You got the handle right here. You're also gonna follow the swipe life on Instagram. We got 
the handle right here. Like and comment on the photo on either of those accounts. I'm gonna put up a contest photo. Add your YouTube handle into the comments, so how I can find you to make sure you followed all the rules. And then also just a little short blurb about why you want to be invited to the Swipe Life screening. And also, 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 muy, muy, muy importante, okay? Muy importante. Please make sure you are available on the weekend of May 26th through 28. Both you and your friend have to be available or that you can maybe make yourself available. I realize we don't have a lot of time, but I will give you enough time to make sure that you can get time off work. You can just make sure that you're available so that you can actually come. I'm so excited to meet one of you. I'm so excited to show you guys the swipe life. Go forth and potate.